All right, in today's video, we're gonna go over what is hands down one of the most bizarre chain of events I have ever seen. Because in January of 2019, Reddit user JimmyJ90210 would make a fascinating discovery. That is, he would make the connection that now Pew 29, which is Finnish for Winnie the Pooh 2929, was in fact Patrick Liney. Reportedly, was reportedly in fact Patrick Liney. Oh, in Minecraft. For legal reasons, I have to do that. <laughs> but here's the thing. If you know somebody's Fortnite username, you can search up all of their gaming history. Games played, wins, losses, the exact time they played those games, which to be honest, is straight up stalking. And keep in mind, I was not the one who did this stalking. But for the sake of science and research, I decided to plug his username in. However, the website is down. The account hasn't been updated in four years, which is a good thing. NHL players already have enough privacy issues. So the fact that fans can log someone's entire spare time is a bit much. However, when the website was up, fans would discover something amazing. In November of 2018, after a slow start, Patrick Liney's reported Fortnite account would go inactive for the first time in months. And I kid you not, in the next 12 games, Patrick Liney would go on to have arguably the most dominant goal scoring run in NHL history, as he would score 18 goals in 12 games, on top of a hilarious one assist. And this run would also include a five goal game. Here's Connor, Liney scores! Patrick Liney win the hat trick! Scores! It's a high five for Patrick Lane! Which of course is incredible from face value. But get this, when a Canadian team has a player who scores five goals in a single game, a random Safeway grocery shopper wins one million dollars. Patrick Laine made a random person a millionaire indirectly from quitting Fortnite. Like, C come on, man. Imagine the world we would live in if Patrick Liney never becomes a gamer. And 18 goals in a 12 game stretch is a 120 goal pace. And before quitting Fortnite, Liney had three goals in the previous 12 games. And considering he had just scored 44 goals the year prior, the Winnie the Pooh 29 account going inactive after a slow start makes a lot of sense. But here's where things get even more bizarre. If we remove the 12 games where he quit gaming, Lainey would have only had 12 goals in the 70 other games that season. He had 6 more goals in that stretch than the rest of the season combined. There was even a day where Lainey's reported account had 14 hours played on a game day. It would go offline roughly 2 hours before game start, where Patrick Lainey would have one of the worst games in his career. And what is even more hilarious about this situation, Lainey started getting flack from the media. Instead of owning up to his gaming addiction to the media, Lainey would would instead hilariously shift the focus to the Canucks, who at the time had just banned Fortnite, as he would say they need something to blame. As if my man's reported account didn't have nearly 7,000 games played. In fact, if we consider that the average Fortnite game lasts 20 minutes, this account racked up over 2,300 hours of game time. And for some perspective, the average 9 to 5 worker works 2,000 hours per year. Meaning, within less than a 2 year stretch, the now Pew 29 account racked up more game time than the average person works in an entire year. With that being said, athletes are allowed and should not be criticized for extracurricular activities. Yes, they get paid millions to play for your team, but they are still allowed to have a life. However, if Patrick Laine did in fact play 2300 hours of Fortnite, I would hope that if his NHL career doesn't work out, we might see Patrick Laine pro gamer. As the Patrick Laine story emphasizes the importance of focus, especially for a man who makes his money from scoring goals. Because when focused, Patrick Laine is one of the greatest natural goal scorers we have ever seen. But when he's not focused, he might as well not even get dressed until he is needed on the power play. Also, dog update, lots of you guys have been wanting it.